Hi everyone. In this video, I'm just uh, doing a time lapse, showing you uh, an idea of what the workflow is for a project like this. This was done for a client. Uh, it's an underground garage with uh, some living space and a tennis court at the top. And so this will give you an idea of how I set it up. I basically start by organizing the AutoCAD drawings, make sure I clean it up, I purge all the unused layers, and then I bring them into Rhino, as you see here. Then I organize them in Rhino, I get them uh, aligned uh, per the elevations, and then from there it's a matter of starting to push and pull and um, start making some decisions on some things that are missed um, in the construction documents. It's a really good idea to once if you work with someone that just uses 2D to go ahead and create the 3D model because there's going to be things that you never thought of or it's uh, it would have taken a very long time to come up with solutions that in the 3D model you can um, visualize and, and be able to kind of solve some of those problems. Uh, but anyway, yeah, it's it's a matter of um, making sure you're uh, using your elevation view and your top view to make sure things are aligned uh, and create find the materials create them yourself yourself if you can't find them um, and yeah it's a it's a matter of kind of taking a look stepping back and seeing if, if things are correct I also got some some marks from from the client and so yeah that's that that's how I updated it and at the end you'll see that I just kind of pan around and and then just kind of give you an idea of what it looks like at the end um, because I didn't it it just takes up a lot of space and it's a little bit difficult to record every single little thing so at the end I just showed you uh, what I have uh, and what I sent the client and then you'll see the renderings so if you have any questions or um, have any other suggestions for videos please let me know thank you very much for watching
Preview.